Welcome to the November 22nd, 2021 Advanced Report for McGowan Group clients and NetworthRadio.com listeners. Happy Thanksgiving. We give thanks for a profitable year and we look forward to success in the future. I'm Spencer McGowan, President, McGowan Group Asset Management, your financial weatherman, a fast-paced tour of the global financial markets each week and each time there's breaking news in the financial markets. So be sure to subscribe and refer your friends that need good sources for investment news. The Dow Jones Industrial Average year to date is our beginning chart again. You can see the low this year, just below 30,000. Uh, 36,005 at the high. Look at this. We have been in a, in a corrective mode for about two weeks now. S&P, CoreLogic, Case Schiller. This is the price of homes nationally. And you can see this 20% gain over the, last, uh, over the last year to two years. That's a huge gain driven by the low interest rates. Macy's, the other buying frenzy besides homes. Wow, retailers this week reported stellar results. Demand is off the charts better than they expected. Uh, we can see it here with Target and their spike. Uh, it has been a great resurgence for the retailers. And now, you know, when you hear shortages, well, you're seeing the retailers actually benefit with the inventory that they do have. Top 10, bottom 10 this week. Dollar Tree was at the top of the list, a private equity firm uh, becoming an activist investor. Etsy, that's more of the retail chain. TJX, the same. Uh, down at the bottom here, Norwegian Cruise Lines, American Airlines, Carnival. There was a COVID resurgence in Europe that sent shockwaves even through the energy markets this week. This is the commodity index. When you hear the word shortages and inflation, while well, you're looking at it right here, it is a commodity boom that is almost unprecedented with global demand being restored. This is natural gas hitting $6.31 according to this chart at the high. The low is $1.50. This winter, you could see natural gas prices. According to some reports, you could see natural gas prices over $10 per million BTUs. And that shortage exacerbated actually by liquid natural gas exportation here in the United States. And here is oil. I did include the pandemic in this two-year chart, minus 37, a high of 84. Oil actually was knocked back below 77 briefly this week uh, with the resurgence in COVID and a couple of European lockdowns. In the past, what it's meant was a temporary situation, and let's pray that is. I'm Spencer McGowan, President, McGowan Group Asset Management. We look forward to seeing you here each and every week. Thank you for tuning in to Net Worth Media today and our efforts over the past two decades to educate clients and help clients make great decisions. That's the reason that we're here at YouTube McGowan Group. Apple Podcasts, Net Worth Radio, and NetworthRadio.com. The Net Worth Media effort is designed to help you make great decisions and address value at risk of loss, fluctuation in the markets. Remember, if we talk about a security, doesn't make it a recommendation until you come down and get a plan from McGowan Group Asset Management, the team that cares. You can set a Zoom meeting or an in-office meeting at the Crescent and we'll give you a written plan that encompasses what we believe to be the best allocations. This is a team of 10 devoted to you. That includes the research that you see each week from Reuters, from Bloomberg, and from the best sources. We always post links at networthradio.com for what we believe can help you make great decisions, the research that comes up. Now, the net worth media effort is also designed to address cycles in the market, value at risk of loss, 
at networthradio.com. You can get the ADV form that shows, yes, we're a fiduciary, a registered investment advisor. It covers the costs of hiring our team to help you in the future ahead. It really helps to have an expert team on your side that you can reach by phone, email, and of course, a team that's here for you every week to address what's going on in the markets because anxiety can often lead investors to make decisions that are either dangerous, chasing things, or selling things when they shouldn't. And that's a big part of our planning effort at McGowan Group Asset Management. Thank you for tuning in, and we look forward to serving you and your family in the years ahead.